up guys welcome back to another video we're here with 317 Sierra Papa back at our home base in Rio Linda we have a flight today we're going to Medford the weather's gonna get a little weird so we're excited to bring you along let's go flying Alright guys, quick starting procedure. Bat one, bat two, strobe light. This is forward, this is forward. Seatbelts coming on. Looking up top, getting the parachute out. Waiting for this. They want to shoot some fuel. Clear on the right, clear forward, clear on the left, clear! Alrighty, welcome aboard guys. We're heading over to Medford, Oregon today. We have the weather, we're going to do our run-up, and then we're going to get out of here. We're going to do a little bit of a different departure than last time. We're going to take off VFR, stay under the class Charlie, pick up our IFR, and then we'll be good to go climb. Welcome aboard guys, and let's go flying. Put in Medford, Kilo, Mike, Foxshot, Romeo. Back to checklist. Cabin heat defrost, alright. So we're going to work our way up to 1700 RPM. We're going to light up the battery. We're looking for positive charge. We're going to go alternator 2 test. Alternator 1 test. Bring that power back a little bit. One to the left. Looks good. Two to the left. That looks good. Back to both. Confirm it's on both. Power's coming back. Real Linda traffic series 317 to your pop. It's departing runway 17 right down on departure. Real Linda. All right, we're clear on the left. We're clear on the right. All my lights are on. Anything goes wrong on the initial ground roll, we'll stop with the runway remaining. We take off with no runway. We're going to keep it straight out. Caps is alive at 600. Everything goes normal. We're going to be making a right downwind departure to the north. Ready? Let's get out of here. Airspeed's alive. Takeoff power is set and achieved. 360 knots. Lots of birds here. There's rotation speed. A little gusty getting out of here. 90 knots, pause the rate, clear of obstacles, flaps coming up. We're looking outside. Beautiful view off to our left. The water ski lake, Spell Aqua. We're clear on the right. Real Linda traffic, Sirius 3170, Papa, right crosswind 17, Real Linda. We're climbing it. Cops is alive. We are clear on the right. Real into traffic, series 3170 Papa, right downwind, runway 17, departing to the north, west last call, Real Linda. Alright, we're going to switch on over to approach, hopefully we can keep our climb going. NorCal departure, hello, series 3170 Papa, off of Lima, 36, 1200, looking to pick up our IFR to Medford, please. Papa North Cal approach, remain clear of the Class Charlie surface area, climb at your discretion in squawk 3357. Alright, 3357, and we will remain clear of the lower end of the Class Charlie. We'll be continuing VFR up to 1 2000 for now for 7 turbo. Alright, so we can't go the lower half of. Papa Ritter, contact 1 mile northwest of Rio Linda Airport, Sacramento altimeter 2983, verify altitude leaving. 2983 position checks were 1.7 for 1.2000 for 7 0 pop. Remember 7 0 pop on your clearance in just a moment. Roger, 7 0 pop, thanks. All right, we're going to go direct. Okay, Roger, enter, enter. Five, six, six, one, zero. We have the weather at Lincoln, and we're going to be doing a. Right, pops are up. Eat or eat's coming on. Of the class dryly, but we can't go into the inner. Reader vectors direct. Climb and maintain 9 or 1000. 
Perfect, one two thousand in five minutes. All right, we're clear to the Medford Airport via present heading, radar vectors direct. We'll maintain 900,000, we'll expect 12,000 shortly for 3170 Papa. Remember 70 Papa, read back, correct. Thanks, sir. North All right, 9, so we're clear this heading. We're already going direct to Medford, so that's nice. So I'll come through to 9 or 8 3. 2 9 or 8 3, 6 with Bravo. November 7th, Sierra Papa, clear direct Medford, contact departure 125.4. 254, direct Medford for 7th, Sierra Papa, good day. Okay. November 4, Tango Tango, turn 10 degrees left, radar vector. NorCal, hello, Sierra's 317, Sierra Papa, 3.2 for 9000, direct Medford. Sierra's 317, Sierra Papa, NorCal approach, hello, maintain 12000. Maintain 12000, 7th, Sierra Papa, thanks, sir. All right, so something about these Cirruses is, is when you're on the climb out, let me be more specific, on the Cirrus SR-22 Tango, I like to keep my fuel flow at about 39 or right in the yellow because it keeps my CHTs way down. If I, you know, if I see my CHT temps go above 380, that kind of catches my eye. And I either bring my indicated airspeed or my flight level change up, or I'll do it is I'll give it more mixture and bring it up to 39. A lot of people scare themselves if they see that yellow and the 39, but that's totally normal. That's that's a healthy plan. All right, so on our route, we have a lot of weather happening here in the northern California area. We got a lot at Reno, a little bit east of Chico. A lot of lightning. I can see that build up right out there. I'll see if I can show you that right now. So yeah, a lot of building up over in Chico. Tapping up back here, uh, nine or four golf. Nine or four golf. That's the plane I did my first solo in. Good. Special flight for me because I get to celebrate 700 hours today. So it's pretty pretty exciting. Well, if you guys are familiar with the area, we got Lincoln Airport off to our right. We also have Auburn off to our right. We got Sacramento International back behind us, and then Beale Air Force Base coming up on the right. The valley is just, I think, one of the coolest places to go flying. You have so much diversity with, you know, you have Truckee, Lake Tahoe, you have the beaches of Sonoma County, you have Eureka, Arcata, you go down, you got San Diego, Catalina, anything you want in California, it's here, especially for flying, so super fun. I think my least favorite place to fly ever is Vegas. It's just always so bumpy, so busy. The first time I did it was really fun. The first five times, honestly, was fun. But now that I've done it a few times, it's like, it's just always bumpy and busy. No matter where you go, too. Excellent. So as the warmer temps come, we have a lot of lifting force. That's why you see all this pretty weather off to our right and left. As the summer goes along, the, the weather should stable up quite a bit, so we look forward to those times, but the plane does not look forward to the heat, that's for sure. 200 to go. So what we do, bring the manifold below 30.5. That gives us I have like a cheat sheet for where a mixture should be. We bring that back to about 17. That's pretty much our flow. We'll switch the tanks, pumps on, mixture's good, flaps up, pedo heat's on, temps look good. All right guys, welcome to 1-2000. We're just over Beale Air Force Base. We're going to take a break up here. We'll catch you on the descent into Medford. We'll see ya. November 0, Charlie Delta, Connect McGuire Approach, 126.47. 126 Brickyard 3650, turn left, heading 150. 150, Brickyard 3650. Thank you, York Helicopter 698, Victor, with you 2000. Alright, what's up, guys? Flight level 180, we have to get above all the weather. Uh, we are above it now, it's super smooth. Should be on the ground in about 24 minutes, so looking good. We're on our descent to Medford. Turn that music off. Alrighty, let's go get the ATIS.
Medford Airport information, Oscar, time 2253 Zulu weather, wind variable at 5, visibility 10, sky clear. Temperature 28, 2.10, Bedford altimeter 2985. IFR arrival, expect a visual approach, runway 32, runway 32 in use. Alrighty guys, so we have Oscar. We're on descent from 17.3 for 12,000. We're gonna expect the visual runway 32. Alrighty, we're now direct. Bedford, we have to deviate around some weather. Start bringing it down a little quicker. Descent checklist auction. We're gonna leave on for a little longer. Altimeters are set two times. Landing lights on, fixture's good, brake pressure's good. This plane's incredible, I mean, I was flying at 12,000, everything was fine, and then a big cell started building up and we were able to climb just right above it, get up in the flight levels. It's just, it's a pretty darn capable plane. And I'm not a jet, I'm a piston, so it's pretty awesome. Cascade, hello, Sears 3170 Papa, 14.4 for 12,000 with Oscar. Sears 3170 Papa, Cascade approach, thank you for Oscar. Expect the visual approach from my 32 at Medford. We'll expect the visual 32 for 70 Papa. We'll be headed to Millionaire when we land. It's one of my favorite FBOs ever. They've, I couldn't say a bad thing about them, they're just incredible. Sears. Seven Sierra Papa, did you want some vectors uh, to the valley for the visual, or do you want to remain direct Bedford? If we could do vectors up the valley, that would be best for Seven Sierra Papa. November Seven Sierra Papa, Roger, turn 15 degrees right, vectors for the visual approach. 15 right for the visual, Seven Sierra Papa. Sierra Seven Sierra Papa, just going to maintain Niner Thousand. Niner Thousand, Seven Sierra Papa. Alright, I'm going to turn the speaker on. I'm going to get this guy off and do a landing checklist. We'll be good to go. Alrighty, into the clouds we go. It's good to me. Get the soup. And we're out of it. Alright, we're 11.4 for 9,000. My oxygen's off. I can move this for you guys. Alright, checklist, checklist before landing. Seatbelts, fuel pump, mixture, flaps, autopilot. It all looks good to me. We of course have flaps to go. The odd dampener to go. And a, a landing clearance would help too. Millionaire Bedford, this is Sears 317 to your papa. How do you hear? Yes, hello, we'll be landing in uh, about 10 minutes. Uh, we're going to need a Lola top off and an oxygen top off as well. We had to go up in the flight levels to get above the storm. So we're doing a quick turnaround, but we'll need those services if you guys have them for 7th Pop. Thank you. Copy that. We'll see you in 10 minutes with a top off on fuel and the oxygen top off. You're awesome. See you soon. Thank you. 7th Pop. See ya. And Cascades here is 3172 Pop. We have the field site. Clear 7 Sierra Pop. A cleared visual approach. Runway 32. Clear visual 3275, so thank you. Alright, we can keep that descent going, we can go procedure, we can go activate vector to the final. 7 Sierra Papa, I'm depicting a few small areas of light precipitation, uh, starting from about 3 miles east of Ashland to uh, 3 miles north of Ashland. Yes, sir, we see that as well. We'll remain VFR and we have all that um, weather in sight, and that is accurate. 7 so Papa. Alrighty, pretty cool again. Vectored into the valley. This is probably my 82nd time landing here in Bedford. No one's counting, but I, I did go and count the other day, so very familiar with this area. It's a great place to go flying. Just spectacular views every time. We got Mount Ashland. Then we have downtown Ashland as we go into Medford. Alright, we're going to start bringing that power back. Sierra 7 Sierra Papa, contact Medford Tower, 119.4, good day. 19.4, good day, 7 Sierra Papa. Medford Tower, good evening, Sierra 3170 Papa, inbound visual 32. Sierra 
3170, Pop Pond, Medford Tower, runway 32, clear to land, wind line variable. 32, clear to land, 70, Pop, thanks. So that gentleman, since I've flown here probably 80 or so times, I wanted to get his name one day and I asked him and he said it was a secret, so I like to just call him secret, but I haven't said that yet. I'm too scared to. Always great service here with Cascade, Oakland, Seattle Center, and especially Bedford Tower there. They're the best. All right, speed checks 150 first notch of pops going in. We'll bring that power back up a bit just to keep those CHTs happy. All right, 2.7, field in sight. We're looking outside. Our power's coming back, white arc, flap full. I'm a little high, but I kind of want that just because someone just departed. And we have to land long anyways for the FBO, so. Greased it. Sears 317 Sierra Papa, say destination. Millionaire 72 Papa. Sears 317 Sierra Papa, Roger, turn left Alpha 3 Alpha Ramp, remain this frequency. Left turn Alpha 3 Alpha Ramp with you. Good day, 72 Papa, talk soon. And the Bonanza calling, is it 554 five, Whiskey? Alright, clear on the right. Clear on the left. Victor. Lights are coming off. Alright, guys, well, I hope you enjoyed the flight. Definitely an interesting flight. 700 hours done, which I'm happy about. Back in the flight levels, first time in over a year. And little do you guys know, I'm about to do it all again right now. Quick fuel up and we'll be headed back. We'll see you next time. Thanks for joining me.